Hello guys, welcome back. Today in this video, we're going to gonna learn something about view depth. So you see, I have a small plan over here. It's a small room and these are these are the walls. And if you go to the uh, 3D view, you can see here the small room. If I press down my middle mouse button and I move, you can see it's panning. And if I want to rotate, then I press down my shift key and I press my middle mouse button. And then when I move my mouse button, you see it rotates. If I want to rotate it with respect to something or a, a component, then first select that component, then press down the shift key, then press down your middle mouse button and move it. Now you see it rotates with respect to the selected wall. Okay. So let's come back to our subject. Let's go back to level two and we can see nothing. Now we go to the east elevation and we see here the level one and the level two, it's 3000 above level one. Since our unit is millimeter, it's 3000 means the level two is three meter above level one. Okay, we go to level two and nothing is visible here as before. So I go to my uh, project browser and when I scroll down, I can see a, an option here, view range and just right to that, I have a button edit i click on this edit and i get this dialog box in which we can see top level associated level level two you don't have to do anything here and next is bottom level associated level level two means uh, means the top and bottom extremities of the range are the same and it's not going to work in that way so let's change that and you see bottom associated level level two let's change it to level one and uh Let's click on this OK, but we get a dialog box error. View depth plane is set above the bottom clip plane. So what's what's the problem here is that uh, we defined the bottom plane as uh, level one, but we still maintain the view depth as level two. So we have to change this to level one and put OK. Now it's visible. Now let's do once again. Let's experiment something. Again, go to view range. And uh, I put this offset to view depth. I put 120, that's 12 centimeters, 120 mm. And I click OK. What's going to happen? The view depth plane is set above the bottom clip plane. That means that uh, now our view depth is above the bottom plane. So it's not possible to create a view here. If we put 120 here, then it's OK. So it's evident that the view depth is at least in line with the bottom range or it can be a little bit below that. But if it is above the bottom range, no view will be generated. If I put this uh, bottom level 140, you see what's going to happen. No problem. Because the bottom plane is above the view depth. So it's not a problem. But if it is below the view depth, then things will not work. Here I put uh, 100, that is 20 centimeter below view depth. Then you see what's going to happen. No, it will not work because the bottom plane is 20 centimeter below the view depth. If it is 20 centimeter above the view depth, I put 140 here then it will work. So I think you at least get something about the view range settings. So that's all with this tutorial. Goodbye.